What's going on everyone? We got the uh, TRX4 Sport. We're taking it out on a trail run today. There we go. Now for me to get up. But I was just gonna show you guys the uh, TRX4 Sport. Um, I think I built this over Christmas. I got the kit. It's got the um, uh, Element Night Runner body on it, which I had to stretch the wheelbase. I'm gonna show you real quick. I had to stretch the uh, wheelbase out on the rear end of the uh, Sport Links. And I just did it by using the uh, TRX4 uh, long arm, the long arm links, link rod ends, yeah. So the TRX4 um, long rod ends is what I use for it. Sorry, it's kind of a mouthful. I couldn't really remember. It's been a while. But we got it out on a little bit of a trail here. Pretty fun area. Bunch of spiders. <laughs> All kinds of good stuff. Let's see if we can get it up on this rock. There we go. Oh no. Very, very fun trail truck. If anything. It's not any type of competition crawler or anything, you know, out of the ordinary, but. It is a fun, it's a really fun trail truck. Let's get through here. Ah, there we go. Got a big downhill spot here. Let's see if we can make it. I'm gonna go ahead and get down first and then we can get the truck down. There we go. She's a very nice truck. I really, I really enjoy this one a lot. I got a um, Hobby Wing Fusion in this one. It's the uh, 1800 KV. Running the um, RC four wheel drive IROC uh, Swamper tires, which they they do really good for the trails, you know, mud and dirt. Oh. And that's one way to get it done. I've tried to go up this a hundred thousand times and it just, you can't get up it. Maybe if I had, well, might be. That route right there is just ridiculous. Maybe if I had an SCX6 or something, I'd be able to make it of it, but I doubt it. We'll keep on moving along.
and that was horse shit. Yep, that was horse poop. That was definitely horse poop. But anyways, I wasn't talking there. Just wanted to give the uh, little bit of clip that I got. Um, the water was a little bit loud, so I didn't feel like having to talk over it. But yeah, I'm trying to watch my footing for horse shit. Excuse my language. That uh, I just ran the truck through. <laughs> so I'm trying to keep my feet out of it. But there's not a lot of uh, trail options here. We basically just came out here to bring your kid out. It's a big gravel road. There's a little bit of trail options off to the side. But, you know, it's just going to be here and there, whatever I can find to get for you guys. But I'll see you at the next spot. See if we can get it down to the water here. Uh, oh, oh. Let's see. Maybe we'll save it. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Clean the tires off a little bit. See if we can get it back up. It's a Toyota. I mean, come on, it should be able to come up this right. Yeah, there we go. I'm telling you, some of the stuff that you guys see, I know that it does no justice, but I'm very amazed that it even came up. With. Well, let's see if we can get us another spot. All right, I think we found our last spot little wet, got flip-flops, don't pay attention to the toes. I don't know how well this is going to work. The tires are wet, it's muddy and mossy. There we go. Seems like we're making it anyways. Now this, uh, I don't know, I don't know how I'm going to get through that, but we're going to try. Act like that never even happened. I think we're gonna make it. thing had rear steer and I could get that wheel over we'd be all right
shot. Come on, they can do it. Alright, we'll have to help it out. That's all it needed. That's all it needed, just a little bit. And there's another one. But anyways, we tried it, nonetheless. But thank you guys for watching another video. Today we did a little bit of a trail adventure and we're gonna head back to the Jeep and get home. Don't forget to uh, like, comment, subscribe, if you haven't already.